much. So, YouTubers, it's your boy Yard Five Zero, presenting Top Gear out of Illinois, one of the better paying company out there. And I'm here at this crane yard picking up this equipment, and I'ma just show you guys, you know, what to look for and uh, how to strap and how I think about strapping, you know, this piece of uh, equipment here. Okay, so. As you can see, I have the first strap here for you know the, the protection of sliding back and forth. I have the second strap here for the protection of holding it down. You know, the third one, I have it right behind this piece right here so it doesn't slide backwards. I have the fourth one right here in front of this piece so it doesn't slide forward. I have the fifth strap over the top holding it down. And the last but not least, stopping it from sliding forward so i got two straps preventing uh forwards uh slide and i also have another two uh at the back to prevent the, the, the backward slide and also a forward slide and two up top to hold down the piece of uh equipment here so it doesn't bounce or anything so yeah you know okay so they decided to add an extra piece on my load and this is a piece right here this big square piece as you can see uh, so what I've decided to do take a take a look you got a couple of holes there so I decided to put my chain through uh, these holes right here because chain is always I'm not gonna say safer than strap you know it's metal against metal comparing to uh, nylon or whatever material straps are is made out of so what i had to do though i had to take out these links in order for it to fit as you can see uh yeah i take out the cattle pin and i had to use my hammer and a pliers to get it out uh, there you go um in order to uh, the chain to go through the slot right here this is a slot i'm using right here there you go and then i'm gonna try to get it to be locked up here that way it still doesn't slide to the left or the right it's very important uh there's you know many different ways you can secure your load you know so it's just you just got to do it to the best of your knowledge that's how flatbed is you know everybody do it different you just have to, as long as you do it safe that's what's most important doing it safe so i'm gonna go on the other side i'm gonna put a few straps over the top too to hold it down but those chains is to prevent it from slide off the trailer also forward and also backwards and when i said off the trailer you'll see what i mean so i put this here like this so i'll go this way and this way or you could have went this way then this way but i prefer this way and also you want to always go on top of the chain but not at the weld as you see here there is a weld there you don't want to put none of your uh your hooks at the well you gotta be uh one of the straight section like this here always on the straight section so for this one same thing i went this way and this way right and they're the same this way and this way it's like you know that that it's like at, at an angle okay so this is what i have here so my chain very tight uh there you go this also stop this from shifting this way uh a strap over the top to you know uh, hold it down and then this one as well very very strong see this here to stop it from you know shifting to the what's that my left you know when you're driving uh, the chain up top to shift it forward and that chain down there to, shift, to stop it from shift uh, backwards uh, all these chains is to stop it from shifting all right 
So that's that's what you want to think about when you're doing flatbed. How can you stop this equipment from going in your cab? So this here, you have to also keep in mind to make sure it's not here. Cause look what I did, you see? I, I It was too close. I had to move it over one. That way it's, I can still be able to ratchet. And then the loose chain, you want to just wrap it over your binder. That way it don't go nowhere. And that's good enough. Uh, so this one here, same thing. Wrap it up, very strong. This one didn't touch anything. It was perfectly aligned. And this here to stop it from slide this way. You know, this stop it from sliding backwards. And you know, this one here also stop it from sliding forward. So that's it. Uh, you know, I got an extra piece. I did try to get extra money. That's the most you can do. You know, hit up your dispatch, say, hey, you're trying to put an extra piece. Can we get more money? You know, you're doing extra work, so you know why not? Least you could do is try. Top Gear, all of Illinois, uh, like, subscribe. You know, leave a comment if you have anything you want to say. Uh, even if you want to say thank you, you know, you just still comment. Uh, thanks for watching, and see you next time. Peace.